What's going on guys? Breelu here. As you guys can tell by the title of the video, I'm going to no longer be doing the monthly Funhouse compilation videos. The best of 2021 is probably going to be my last. Although, that being said, I did also just upload uh, the best of Ryan's Bargain Bin Season 2. Mostly because it was already edited since, you know, I was doing the monthly Funhouse videos, right? Like for November and December. And those videos were basically already edited, so I'm like, okay, I'll just literally just mash them into one video and then upload them. So even, even though I am stopping doing the monthly videos, I have also been thinking about doing a, like a final farewell to Funhouse video, where it would be from 2015, like the beginning of Funhouse, to the end of 2021, essentially where I, I stopped doing the monthly Funhouse videos. But... I mean, that's going to be such a huge project. I never actually do get around to actually doing it because, yeah, there's just so many videos. It's, what, six, seven years of uh, fucking almost daily videos <laughs> that I have to go through. It's going to be a lot. So now, you may be asking the question, why? Why all of a sudden? Why am I deciding to quit? Now, um, now I have been thinking about this for a while now, like the past several months or so. But essentially what it comes down to is I'm just not enjoying it as much as I used to. Like I used to look forward to like watching their videos daily and I would watch it like the same day and I was so excited to, to watch it. But now it's just like I'm just not enjoying it as much as I used to. Which some of you guys may have noticed due to a few months being around like 15 to 30 minutes long. Now I just want to say this. I have nothing against the new crew at Funhouse. I'm still subscribed to the channel. I still watch almost all the videos. Although that being said, I am like a week or two behind on videos. At, at the time of me recording this uh, voiceover, I just watched the Gabagool like Sopranos video th that they did. And like I said, in the past, I would basically be all caught up basically on the same day that they would upload. And I would be so hyped to watch it. And But now it's like, yeah, it's just not as enjoyable as it once was. I'm not, like, I'm a week or so behind on watching the videos. Like, I don't feel the hype or the excitement. Like, I don't feel the need to be like, okay, I need to go watch this right now. In the past videos, I would have so many, like, deep belly laughs. And now it's just like, I get maybe a laugh or a chuckle, like, once or twice a video. Now. And it's just... It's just different. I don't know. Like, And the second reason, but this one's probably like definitely a lot lower in the totem pole um, of the reasoning uh, thing is that it is definitely, it's a big time sink. It's a big time commitment to each month have to go through and edit this monthly video. It's a lot of videos. It's like, it's not the hardest thing in the world. You know, I'm not funhouse. I'm not going in here editing my own original content and having to come up with like scripts or some stuff like that. But at the same time, it's not the easiest thing either. Like it does take a lot of time to go through and edit these videos, these like 30 plus videos per month that end up being what six, it takes six plus hours or so of unedited footage. So it's six plus hours of having to go through and like edit it. So it's the best of um, type of thing. And it's just like, yeah, I could be doing other things with my time in the in, instead of doing that. You know, I could be like editing my own videos. I could be hanging out with friends. I could be furthering a relationship with, you know, a, a, like a significant other. I could be, you know, furthering my schoolwork. I could be, you know, focusing on my actual nine to five job that actually pays that actually pays me money. This, you know, YouTube doesn't pay me money. Like my actual nine to five job that I go to pays me money, I could be focusing on that and maybe making more money and all that. But the reason why this is not as big a reasoning as me for me quitting is because you can, people can put up with that as long as, as long as it's enjoyable. But the bit with the one main reason, like I said, is that it's just not as enjoyable. So that's the reason why now all these other problems of like, oh, this, you know, I don't like this or I don't like that. That's also compounding and but it's like those type of things you can put up with, like, if you like, let's say you really enjoyed, like, doing your hobby, then it's like, okay, you, you can put up with like, oh, it takes a lot of time to do this, or maybe not a lot of people watch 
this, but it's sort of like, if you enjoy doing it, then that's all that really matters. And, you know, if you have a lot of fun and you enjoy doing it, then, and I don't want to come across as those type of commenters where it's like, oh, new Funhouse sucks. Or I want the old crew back or anything like that. Like, personally, I do prefer the old crew. I do like the old videos as well. But at the same time, yeah, I realize it's not going to come back and it's just not going to be to how it was before and it's not, it's not going to return to that. So I should just move on. I feel like it's valid to be kind of like, you know, a little bit or at least express your opinion of being like, hey, I prefer the old crew and all that, and I don't really enjoy it as much as I used to. And I think that's a leg I, and I think that's legitimately fine. You can feel that way. The same way that I feel that it's also fine to enjoy the new Funhouse as much as, even if, let's say, you enjoy it even more than old Funhouse, or just as much, and, and you like the new crew. Like, that's fine, too. I feel like both ways is fine. I, it, it just kind of annoys me when one side or the other is is all like my way is the right way and you know all, all that because because at the same time like funhouse is kind of like a basketball team if you want to think about it in that way where like the 1970s like the 70s and 80s la lakers are not is not the same la lakers now like in the 2022 season right so like things change things move on it's like that saying of don't don't be sad that it's over be happy that it happened but also on the other hand i do recognize i'm not delusional um things have kind of gone down downhill and a lot of people a lot of people have this opinion of mine too that we prefer the old like at their peak funhouse was was what like 1.67 million subscribers i think what i remember and now it's like almost 1.5 million subscribers they lost like 17,000 or so, or yeah, they lost 170,000, I think, subscribers. They used to hit almost, what, in between 300,000 to 500,000 views per video. Um, and it, yeah, it would fluctuate. Sometimes they would almost hit like a million. Sometimes they would get lower than, they, they would get around 100,000. Now it's like they barely even get to 100,000, 100K views per video. It's around like 50,000 to... No, it's around like what 30, 40,000 to like about 60, 70,000. It's just like like they're not reaching new people or they're not reaching the people that they once were reaching before. I think they're one they, I think they had like one or two videos that was over a little bit over 100,000 and that was because they had Bruce in it for like their Red Dead Redemption series. And yeah, so yeah, I, I think a lot of people feel this way like I do, and I feel like it's it's perfectly fine to feel that you prefer old Funhouse or if you prefer new Funhouse. It's just, it's up to personal preference, right? It's kind of like comedy. Like, not everyone's going to like the same type of comedy or not everyone's going to find the same things funny. It's unfortunate, too, because I was thinking about splitting up my YouTube channel and making a new channel, like, just for Funhouse videos. And then leave this channel with my own videos and all that, like I have been doing since for like a decade or something now. But now that I'm basically going to retire from the monthly videos, um, I don't know, I feel like there's no point in really doing that now. So I don't know if I will do that. Um, but I will, I think I will occasionally do some compilations here and there. Like I mentioned, um, I did just upload the Ryan's Bargain Bin Season 2, Best of... And then I am thinking about doing that huge 2015 to 2021 uh, Funhouse video, but this one will definitely take a while to edit. It's gonna take. It's gonna take. It's gonna be a big project because it's what six, almost seven years of just like daily videos that you got to go through and find the best of the best. And also, it's probably gonna be under like 12 hours, just under 12 hours too. It's gonna be hard to fit it into just 12 hours, because I think that's like the limit of how far. YouTube videos can go like very complex YouTube videos because I know that there are like over 12 hour YouTube videos but like they sometimes just have like a static image with audio and that doesn't I guess I'm assuming it's if you have like a very complex video with a lot of stuff going on if, if it's like a video one like you probably just can't upload it because it's too big of a file I don't know because I tried to do that for the 2019 one which is why 2019 is split up into two parts because it was over, like, slightly over 12 hours. So you may be wondering, what am I going to do now? 
well, like I said, I'm going to continue doing my own videos on this channel. Um, I basically just do this for fun. I enjoy playing video games and playing them with friends. I have been uploading videos. I've been doing videos on this channel for, I think, almost a decade now. Obviously, initially, I started it to become famous on YouTube, like everyone does, right? Because I love playing video games, and I'm like, okay, well, I'm really good at this, and I, enjoy, I spend a lot of time doing it, so I might as well, you know, I'll, I'll try and see if I can make a living off of it. But, you know, over time, it's just developed into a hobby, and I enjoy doing it. It's fun. I love trying to make people laugh. I love trying to show off, like, really cool gameplays of, like, oh, wow, I got, like, 50 kills and zero deaths, or, you know, this really cool move I did, or, like, this funny thing that happened, this, or, the, like, a weird glitch that happened in this game, or, you know, just shooting the shit with my friends on the couch or whatever, right? We're all in the same room and just it's talking nonsense, right? Because, like, that was one of the reasons why I initially started watching Funhouse to begin with, is was because it had that kind of, like, N64 feel of, like, you would go over to your friend's house back in the day and you'd pop in, like, you know, Mario Kart Double Dash or Super Smash Bros. and you're talking shit and you're and you're just doing jokes and you're and you're just having fun playing games together. Like, which is why I, I enjoy doing that with my friends now, too. Like, it's just fun. Like, if I can make just one person laugh because of something stupid I said, then... I feel like I've done something right, or I've done something correct. I don't know, I just, I sort of just stumbled upon doing the monthly videos. Like, I, I've mentioned this before, but in a, in a previous video, but like I kind of started it obviously because I'm a fan of them. And at the time, fun, the Funhouse channel themselves occasionally would actually upload their own compilation videos. But it was almost always too short for me. It was like 15 to 25 minutes or so. Then I stumbled upon Captain Pajama Pants, which I think a lot of us did as well. And I was, and then I was like, oh, this is perfect, right? Because they were like an hour long or so. But then over time too, I felt like I felt like even he was like missing some videos here and there or some clips. And I'm like, oh, why didn't he add this clip or that clip? Or why didn't he extend that clip longer? Like the whole thing was funny. Why is it only like 10 seconds of this one clip? And then that was the reasoning uh, behind me making my original Best of Funhouse video, which has almost 4 million, I almost said subscribers, but it has almost 4 million uh, views now, which is almost 4 million, which is, uh, it's kind of insane to think about now. It's crazy. Thank you guys for watching that, if you guys have. Um, but yeah, so I had upload, that's the reason why I made that video. And then like a year after, a year or so, like, after I uploaded that video, like, it just blew up. And then, so I felt like I had to continue doing the Funhouse videos for you guys. And then, obviously, the rest of that is history. And that's why I started doing, like, the Funhouse videos and the monthly ones and all that. And, yeah, uh, I understand if you guys don't want to stay. But if you guys like a silly goose time with three idiots saying stupid shit, uh... You know, I, I, I would definitely appreciate it if you guys would stick around, because that would be great too. Um, now, I know I said I might not do this, but I have actually been thinking about making a new channel anyways. But instead of, instead of doing like Funhouse videos, I would do like comedy podcast compilations. Just because I think that it would be hilarious, and I don't really think anyone else is doing that. There's like compilation, there are some compilation channels doing them, but like they're only like 30 minutes and then like they really like clips here and there. I was thinking about doing like just massive ones of like, you know, an hour to two hour long, uh, kind of like what I do for Funhouse, but longer for like these compilation, for like these comedy podcasts. Because I also already watch and listen to like a lot of them throughout the week, like weekly. Like, for example, Bad Friends, Long Days with Giannis Papas, Your Mom's House, Congratulations, uh, Chrissy Chaos, etc., etc. So, I think I may do that sometime soon. Um, I will make a, like a community post about it when I uh, eventually end up doing it, or when I eventually end up 
uploading or posting the video. But yeah, uh, I don't know what to say. <laughs> it was a good run. Uh, a few years or so of being like the monthly videos guy. Taking over from Captain Pajama Pants. Um, but yeah, I think it's time for me to move on as well. And to do other stuff that I would enjoy more. Or doing more, right? So yeah. Thank you guys seriously a lot for watching the videos. And for sticking around for this long. And for sticking around hopefully this long in the video itself. Um, I truly do appreciate it. You guys watching the silly videos I make. Like I said, I just do them for fun. It's just a hobby. I just enjoy doing it now. I feel like I just, I just, I want people to see. And if I can, I want people to see. And I, I like trying to make people laugh. That's the whole reasoning. Um, so yeah. So like I said, to wrap it up, I'm still going to be uploading my own videos on this channel. And maybe, and maybe start a new comedy compilation channel. But unfortunately, I will no longer be doing the Funhouse ones. Except for maybe once in a while. I don't know if I should upload those ones to this channel still or upload it to the new comedy channel that I will eventually make. Um, you guys can leave a comment down below, whichever one you guys think is better or whichever one you guys would prefer me doing. So yeah, so uh, that's all I have to say for this video. I do hope some of you guys stick around, although I understand if you guys don't, it's, you know, it doesn't matter. You guys are here for Funhouse anyways. Obviously, by the, you know, I'm not an idiot, too. Like, the views on the videos, obviously, like, the Funhouse ones are a lot higher than my own aren't all that much. But, I don't know, if you guys like three guys trying to, you know, doing stupid shit and just having a silly goose time, I would implore you guys to watch uh, some of my stuff. But, yeah, thank you guys for watching. Like I said, it's uh, it's been a wild ride. <laughs> I'll see you guys in the next video, though, or whatever I decided to do next. Peace.